They, they definitely, uh, they're big boys. They are definitely big boys. They're heavyweights, man. They're here to bang and see what happens. All I can say is I'm glad I'm here at the booth with you and uh, not up there. I am way too pretty to get hurt by these guys. My feet are faster than Rich Thurston. I would just move from them. Gotta they touch gloves. <laughs> and here we go. Dominic Steele popping a jab and a right hand. Rich Thurston using his feet, keeping control of the distance. Fires right hand counter punch. Jab himself. A little bit of movement. Nice. Keeping the distance. It's making the Dominic Steele right now reach for him. It's making him reach for him. Nice takedown by Dominique Steele. Dominic Steele on top. It's in half guard. Rich Thurston is a little bit of a butterfly guard there, controlling right arm. Dominique Steele was trying to trap that left arm down. Rich defending himself nicely. Nice and calm. Now, what are some of the strengths of uh, Rich Thurston? He's got a good ground game. His Muay Thai is very good. His movement's very good on his feet, as you saw right before. But he's on the ground right now on his back, and he's defending himself very well. He's moving his hips very well. He's creating separation and space with his legs. He's covering his face. Right now, Dominique Steele is just raining these fists down onto the head really of Rich not Thurston. He's not landing in anything. He's, these are nothing punches. Rich is not even. He's blocking all of these. Rich is. He's in half guard right now. And Rich pulls his left leg up over and crosses it so that Dominic does not full mount him. Drives a knee in. Nice, Dominic did. Not a lot going on right here, Rich. Rich is defending himself very well. Dominic's trying to, is he working for some sort of an arm submission? I don't know if he can pull that or not. Right now, Dominic Steele is absolutely trying to keep. And full mounted. Rich nice. Thurston full mounted by Dominic Steele. He went for, the, for an arm bar. Actually, Kimura, and he lost it. Dominic Steele has Rich Thurston's back. Oh, he just let Rich go. Defending. Dominic Steele does not have the hooks in. Rich would be, he should buck up and shoot him off his hips and scoot to the side. I tell you what, this Rich Thurston for being a big guy, he is very quick. Very quick, he, and he should actually take advantage right now before it changes to a Rich, I'm sorry, a Dominic Steele's legs are not hooked in by him. It's a mistake by Dominic Steele. Rich should buck him just like he did right there. He's back in, half mounted by him. Dominic still giving up a big opportunity, having his back not sinking the hooks in. And doing it again right here. He should be, Dominic Steele should be sinking the hooks in. And he's trying to, and he's not doing that. He's not gonna get a dominant position on the backside of Rich Thurston without doing that. It looks like Rich Thurston is calling for his trainers to come on in. Does appear there's a problem. I don't know if it's with his eye, if he got gouged or jabbed in the eye. It looks like he sustained some type of injury. As they're attending uh, to Rich Thurston, let's talk about that first round. There was many, many opportunities for Dominique Steele, but Rich Thurston was very good on his defense, was very good at thwarting the efforts of Dominique for getting really any true mount on him. Very true. Uh, Neil Rowe over assisting to Rich Thurston. Jared Combs, who's been working with uh, Dominic Steele, Jared, Jared Combs is a fighter out of my gym. Let's see what's going to happen here. And this is one thing that you hope is just a, a glancing scratch to the eye or something like that, that it's nothing serious because these guys are gamers, they're going at it hard, and the last thing that you want to see, and I think the last thing that one of your opponents want to see is a match end by injury. Rich Thurston unable to continue. Well, it's an unfortunate situation right here, but like Jason said, 
It was an accidental foul, was nothing intentional. And it's just a shame because these two guys look like they were going to put on one incredible fight for rounds two and three.